We have a haul. Hi everyone, welcome, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are doing a haul. My first unboxing haul. They are all here. <laughs> so I bought these books uh, the end of March and today is April 7th and I have not opened not one of them. I just have not because I wanted to keep them for this video and now it's finally time for me to open them and I do not remember. Like I remember like maybe four books that I bought but I do not remember any of the book that I bought and I didn't want to go on Amazon and see because I wanted it to be like a surprise for me too. <laughs> like I wanted it to be a nice little surprise when I opened it. I'm like oh I ordered you. They didn't, they didn't remember. So yesterday I found myself on TikTok and usually I don't spend too much time on TikTok because like, like I'm gonna buy a book that someone's like this book changed my life and I'm like like this is my favorite book and I'm just like is it going to be my favorite book so that happened that that happened because I went to Target and I got three more books on top of all these books did I need to no no but I did I, I did I got, I got three books from Target and the first one is if it had been with me and Basically, I bought it because the girl was just like, POV, you have good taste. And then I saw another one that says, POV, you like to cry. And I'm just like, well, I have good taste. And if there's anything I like my heart to be broken by, is a book. So let me get it. So I got it. Um, Autumn and Finn were childhood best friends and they are now enemies, I think. Yes, they are now enemies. And I'm just like, childhood best friend turns enemies? I want to read that so I got this one and I got the cheat sheets I think this is about two best friends and she's in love with him and I'm just like oh best friend turns to lovers that's cute I want to read it the back of it says it is never too late it is is it ever too late to leave the friends this is I like that like she's in love with him this is cool I, I, I really like that because I usually read books where he falls first so now that she's falling first it's like Okay, that's different. I like it. The third one that I got is Icebreaker. And did I get this book? Because everyone is TikTok was saying it's steamy. Yes, yes I did. However, I also, <laughs> I also saw a video where she says that the girl was the grumpy one in this and she, he was the golden receiver. And I like that. I really do. Because I like reading grumpy sunshine but it's usually like where the boy the, the 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 male character is usually grumpy and the girl is sunshine so i'm just like it's nice to see a switch where she's the grumpy one and he's the sunshine one i like that you know this is nice now we are going to the yeah, amazon boxes you can't see it but they here this is this this is our first victim and i was like saying it because like i can't i don't know which one is in this one this A love hate thing oh my god i'm so excited because let me tell you i read the synopsis of this and i was just like this is given the oc but black <laughs> the reason why i said this is just given the oc vibe you know how in the oc ryan got in trouble with his big brother and then he went to jail and then his lawyer came and basically helped him and they brought him home and to leave with them and he fell in love with the girl next door this is what it's given me but except that he got shot and i think someone but him to her house so they're living under the same roof and i'm just like oh this sounds so good so basically the back of it says he said getting shot isn't the worst part is the aftermath and then he also said it's hard to believe that once upon a time we were friends they were friends i didn't even know that they were friends and she says i don't care about the troublemaker my parents are bringing into a home she says this is my summer and no one is getting in the way of that i love this oh my god am i leave this for summer or am i read it at the beach because i'm going to the beach saturday tomorrow today's friday so i'm going to reach tomorrow so i might go with this and i might read it but i am so excited because i love the show the oc and i just i'm like oh my god this just gives me the oc this one 
There's three in this one. Okay, there's three. Oh, oh my god, I'm so excited. <gasps> Girls in pieces. Girl in pieces. So, in Girl in pieces, I bought it simply because I have heard. I heard that your heart is gonna break. It's gonna rip you apart. And trust me, there is nothing in this world I love more than opening a, opening a book and crying where your tears drop on the pages. I love that. You leave tear, tear marks basically on the pages. And I just, when, I, when someone said, listen, trigger warning, do not read this book, da da da. And I was like, oh, now I wanna read it. Second one is, before the coffee gets cold, I bought it because of the cat. <laughs> But, but afterwards, I went on TikTok, I saw some people talking about it and I actually didn't regret it at all. And I'm excited to read this one. And then this is the second one I was so excited to because I don't read mystery at all. Like I don't read thriller, I should say. I don't read thriller books at all. But one of my favorite YouTubers talked about this one and she said she didn't like like thriller books but she loved this one and i'm just like okay so i might love that one because i do not like reading about you know thriller i don't want to know i don't want i don't like scary stuff you know i stick to romance and why but this one was very very intriguing to me because her husband cheated on her and she's a lawyer and um his mistress ended up dead they're saying that he did it i think and her his wife is basically the best lawyer and he needs a lawyer so he's hiring hiring his wife to be the lawyer after he cheated would you do that no i would not it says would you defend your husband if he was accused of killing his mistress who are you who is this man i have never seen this man in my life this that i would say that honestly this is our next one okay this one is <gasps> this is the one i was excited for a thousand boys kisses they were friends childhood friends and he had to go away and when she come back the girl like his best friend basically isn't talking to him anymore and then he says why did the girl who was why did the girl who was one half of his soul who promised to wait fitfully for his return cut him off without a word of explanation? I want to know why. I want to know why because why would you do that to him? Okay. <laughs> Before we were strangers. It's a love-hate love story. That's cute. Oh, I just read the synopsis. Loki, it reminds me of... <laughs> It just reminds me of this one because he went away and this one says we met 15 years ago they were good maybe in a relationship somehow and then she went away in South America to work and when she came back he was gone so that's well he wasn't gone she just wasn't talking to him she wasn't gone she was just she just wasn't talking to him but he's gone I've heard really good things about this one I've heard good reviews oh my god this one is gold by alexandra house and i love her books oh my god i'm gonna put some of her books here she's such an underrated author because i don't read i don't hear her name enough but let me tell you the way she writes the way she describes things i love i always love my favorite two like my two favorite books of hers is let me hold you and let me love you or let me feel you I, I'll put it up, but I love these two books. So when I saw that, and I was just like, okay, this is cool. And she write basketball romance because let me show you, or let me hold you. I'm not quite sure. I'll put it up. It's a basketball romance, and I love that one. This is a hockey, right? Hockey, and it's a black couple. Who doesn't like that? It's hockey, black, yell yeah, black men. I love that. I love that for us. This is good. And I'm excited to read this one. This one is my dog Vanessa. Um, but this one because I've heard it's about this woman reflecting on her relationship with the with and on her relationship with this adult. She was in she was 15 in relationship with this adult men, and she's just reflecting on it now. She's just like that was not a relationship like at all whatsoever. I don't know where I was 
do not know where I was. I just know my camera stopped. So I need and this is the third time stopping. So if I'm like speeding through this, that's that's why. That one is the literally right here says heartbreaking, so I know it's going to break my heart. Oof. Now this one is charming as a verb. I love the title. I love the the cover because look how beautiful it is. Everything is colorful and I'm just like it's giving New York. Are they New York? They are New York. <laughs> as you he could charm anyone until now okay <laughs> plus it reminds me of love radio and i love love radio because i finally read it and it was nice so i got this one and it <laughs> the love cone i bought the love cone simply because of how she stressed look at it can you see <laughs> basically they are two best friends and she loves anime and dressing up as you probably can tell and she got into this she got into this competition and she needs his help that's what i got from that from the synopsis from the little fast read that i just gave it she got into this competition to win something and he's her best friend he's going to help her and i i wanted to read it plus it's pink it's nice it's pink She's a beautiful black thick girl, which I love, and he's her best friend. This box, I don't know how many is in there because I'm just like, oh, how many did I buy? <laughs> Yar, okay, so I got Dear Amelia. I bought this because it said Seattle. If you don't know, I'm writing a CV, she must plug. I'm writing, not a series, I'm writing a book about basketball type thing. I'll talk about it soon, <laughs> one day, if I have the guts to. It's based in Seattle, so any book that says based in Seattle or love in Seattle or something like that, I'm excited to read. But I bought it because of that, honestly. But it's a short book, I'm sure I'm going to love it. Next one I have is Love and Color. Listen, do not know what this book is about. Don't know. Do not know. I just know. I saw the cover, I saw the color. And I'm like, yes, definitely. Yes, it's called Love and Color. And he says, mythical tales from around the world retold. Oh, they don't know that. <laughs> I, like, you know how they say, don't judge a book by its cover? I judge that book by its cover because I'm just like, it has to be beautiful. Look at it. Like, hello. Okay, so this, this book, I bought it because the sun is also a star love that book like i read it two years ago loved it saw the movie didn't love it as much but i love that book and i just like didn't read anything from that author anymore and then like i started following her on tiktok and then she says when someone read my books and they end up crying and i'm just like you wrote everything, 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 everything was quite sad. You wrote The Sun is also a star. And now you're telling me this one is going to break my heart. Okay. <laughs> tomorrow, 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 and tomorrow, and tomorrow. Let me tell you. Do not know a thing about this book. Cannot help you. I love the cover. Look at the beautiful colors. It looks like a beautiful rainbow. I already them my outro. And I look down and there's this book. We forgot it. So it's two books. Okay. Good. <laughs> what I forget? Look, look, look. This is normal people. I I was watching Steph for Steph. Steph. You will know her. I was watching Steph and I think she says this is one of her favorite books. And I finished watching her video. I went on TikTok and I opened TikTok. The first one I saw was talking about this book and I was like, oh okay. And then I went down like three tiktok three videos it was like normal people and i'm like oh okay what's going on and i kept going and then even just like get this book because <laughs> like four more people talked about it and i'm like okay well, let's just get it this one i love it i love it. oh i'm just loving the cover i'm gonna put them here somewhere somebody has to see this it's called love is a revolution and oh uh, look at it it's perfect i think it was like a me cute moment i think she went to a mic open mic open mic 
open mic and she saw him and he felt she fell in love with him basically is that perfect so yeah so this one fell in love with it my camera is flashing i gotta go i already did the outro i did anyways this is really nice i love this one thank you guys for watching this video i am so nervous i feel like i was breathing heavily this whole video and if i was i am so sorry about that i'm sorry please forgive me anyways thank you so much for watching hope you liked it give it a thumbs up if you did and if you didn't it's okay it's fine <laughs> it's fine it's fine <laughs> but yeah if you liked it give it a thumbs up and i'll see you in the next video bye thank you for watching take care of yourself bye